Alright, resuming from here. I think we are about to get some answers to a few questions. Shut up. I'm gonna put another bullet in you. Yeah, real tough guy. Five on one and you still had to shoot me. Piece of shit. Just hope they find what we're looking for, for your sake. <laughs> they won't, because I gave them the wrong code. Yeah, that's right, asshole. What now, tough guy? You gonna shoot me? Again? We have ways of getting around security. How do you think we got into this shithole? First, you break in, shoot me in the gut, tear the place up, and now you insult my digs? That's cold, man. But please shut up. And you better plan on replacing my rug. That one really tied the room together. <laughs> Good night. Put that away, unless you're gonna finish me off. All right, all right, the gun holstered. Jensen, oh Christ. Brent Radford? In the flesh, for now. How do you know my name? What happened here? Answers for favors. There's a, a trauma kit I keep somewhere around here. Find it. You need a doctor, I'll get help. No, no time. The. They could be back any minute. Find the kit quickly if you want answers. I'll be back. Trauma cats. Trauma, 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 chameleon. Don't lie, that's a good sign. Why the hell is this trauma kit? Yeah. Come on, you. Did you find the kit? Oh, sweet Jesus. The pain. Morphine. There we go. There we go. This should help with the pain. Now tell me what's going on. Those sons of bitches. I should have seen it coming. I knew from the moment Saraf got spooked that, that this case would come back and bite me in the ass. Saraf. So you're the investigator he hired to run a background check on me? Detective. Or I was, until... Christ, fuck it. It hurts enough just trying to breathe. Point is, the goons that did this to me, professionals. I think your boss pissed off the wrong people, trying to dig up your... Dirt. What people? What did you find? No time to, to go into details. My storage unit, the sons of bitches, they're headed there now. Saref had me uncover a ton of shit on you. Stuff even you don't, you don't know. Your parents, your, your real parents. The tests, the fire. What are you, Jensen? Some kind of... Freak. Focus, Radford. I put it all. I mothballed the case in storage. It's in an alley. Behind the bank. Your files are there. But Michelle knows. Michelle knows more. You need to stop. You need to stop them. Fuck. <laughs> you robot. This this is all your fault. Give me. Give me another shot. Morphine. Or go fuck yourself. 
Focus, Radford. Ah, that hit the spot. I think I could get used to this stuff. Hey, I'm feeling a little more talkative. Already. Robot. Radford, I know you're in a lot of pain, but it's important you give me as many details as you can. There's a storage unit in the alley next to the bank near the police department. That's where the suits are headed. I tried. Didn't give them anything. There's a safe. It has what you want. It'll get you to her. It'll lead you to her, to Michelle, the safe. They don't have the, the right combination. Four, zero, six, two. Remember. You mentioned someone named Michelle. Who's Michelle? Uh, your guardian angel. Who is she? Tell me. Do robots believe... Do robots even believe in angels? Or did they take that out of you? Did they take that away? You know, your soul. When they built you. <laughs> Tell me. What was it like when you died, Jensen? I know you're in a lot of pain and the morphine is... Just find her. Before they do. You... You owe her that much. Who did this to you? Guys in suits. One of them. David or Daniel, something like that, British accent. He was in charge. Talked about a Mr. Mr. Gray. They were in a, a hurry, four of them. Not counting the one they left behind. Well-armed, disciplined. I, I didn't stand a chance. Maybe that metal corpse you call a body will do better than mine did. What were they looking for? You robot. They wanted my information on you. Someone powerful has their eyes on you and is very interested in your past. Why did Seraph stop the investigation? You said he was spooked. What spooked him? You wouldn't believe me even if I told you. <laughs> Hell, even I don't. I still don't believe it. You believe in ghosts, Jensen? Seraph was spooked by ghosts. Close enough. Illuminati. <laughs> Conspiracies, theories, it's all bullshit. But you stink of it, Jensen. Enough to have your boss, one of the most powerful men in the world, look away. <clears throat> You're a ghost. A fucking tragedy. Everything you touch, everything that touches you, dies. I think that's all. Is there anything you can give me to help? Take whatever you want from here or the storage unit. There's a weapons cache and some money there. Yeah, that's all. I'm leaving, but I'll call in an ambulance. You'll be okay. No. Those fucking animals. I, I can't move anything. I was turning around pulling my gun when, when the first bullet hit me. The second one, they, they fucking pa paralyzed me. I'm sure it's not as bad as you think. It might be a reaction to the morphine. I know what morphine does. I also know what a nine millimeter round fired at less than 10 meters does to the thoracic vertebrae on impact. You need a doctor. They can fix that. I ain't turning into no freak. Even if I could afford the surgery, the augments, I'd rather die than be half a machine. And I sure as hell ain't gonna live the rest of my life in a wheelchair, shitting in a goddamn diaper. Radford. Listen, I know there's still a few more morphine shots. Another two should, should do the trick. Please, this is as close as I'm gonna get to begging you. Don't leave me like this. You owe me that much. 